you and me are supposed to run a business in which we are supposed to send the employees to different locations. Now many times the employees come back stating that they have to pay for the toll charges, parking charges, etc. So we have agreed to give them a stipend to defray some of their charges. So here's what you're supposed to do. In the column number F, you are supposed to calculate their pay using the formula hours into rate per hour. Then, basis the location, you have to also calculate their stipend in column number G. And finally, in column number H, you are going to add the salary plus their stipend to give the final salary. And lastly, you are supposed to create a pivot table showing the final amount to be paid to each employee. So, you can pause the video, go ahead and try to find this solution. Afterwards, you can come back and I'll show you how you can do the same. Well, now that you are back, let me show you first how to calculate the basic salary. So, we'll first insert one column. So, we'll come over here, right click over here and we'll insert one column. Then we'll give the heading like basic and we'll give the formula equal to hours worked multiplied by rate and hit enter. Then we'll copy this formula down. Now we want to calculate their stipend. So, we give the heading like stipend and over here we'll use a formula called as VLOOKUP. So, we type equal to VLOOKUP open bracket what value to look up. So, we want to look for location comma where you want to look for location in this area comma what value you want to pick up from. We want to pick up the value from column number 2 and do you want an exact match? So, we type 0, we close bracket and hit enter and then we copy the formula down. Well, so here we have now got everybody's stipend. Let's convert this into currency. So, home and we select currency. And we'll calculate the final salary, which would be equal to basic plus stipend. And we'll just copy this formula down. Come to insert, select pivot table, select new worksheet, click on OK. Then I want the employee ID on separate rows. And in values, I want the final value. Then I can just select this column and make it to currency. And now we have every employee's ID and the final amount which has to be given to them. And we are ready to send this to the payroll.